Hi, I'm Professor Van Strembath. I'd like to respond to the question about cohabitation or living with someone when you're not married. There are lots of other people who may have responded to this, but here's my response. Uh, you are adults. And if you're struggling with, is it a sin if I move in with my significant other? Start with this. What is sin? Sin is damage to persons, relationships, right? Sin is damage. And that's what you have to ask yourself. Does, does the way that my partner and I are navigating our sexual expression and intimacy, is that damaging to one of us, to both of us, or actually to the relationship? Because you know what? Sometimes deciding to live together before you get married actually damages your relationship. Sometimes deciding to live together and to be more free and open about your sexual expression, sometimes that helps the relationships flourish. But there's that should be the starting point. With regard to sin, the first place that you discern where sin is happening is in your inner life in your relationship with the living God and inside the relationships that help you flourish. So is it a sin to cohabit? Depends on where the damage is happening. Thank you.